Hello everyone, my name is Bhakeshri and today we are going to learn about the immunodeficiency diseases. So let's look into detail. Now immunodeficiency diseases, they occur when one or more components of the immune system is defective. Now the immunodeficiency diseases may be primary or secondary and it is caused by the defect in one or more genes which is involved in the development of function or the function of the immune system. It is called as primary immunodeficiency. Now a deficiency in the immune system which is acquired after birth usually because of infection and that it is not related to a genetic defect it is called as secondary or acquired immunodeficiency. Now the example of in primary immunodeficiency diseases. First one is the severe combined immunodeficiency. Now it is a genetic disorder which is characterized by a common by a very low number of circulating lymphocytes. Here both arms of adaptive immune system become non-functional as such patients make neither specific T cell dependent antibody responses nor the cell mediated immune response and thus it cannot develop immunological memory. Now there are several different defects which can lead to SCID phenotype. In X-linked SCID, which is the commonest form of SCID, SCID it means severe combined immunodeficiency. T cells, what happens? It fails to develop because of the defect in gene score for several cytokine receptors. Now it also includes the interleukins, which are IL2, 4, 7, 9, and 15, and the autosomally inherited SCID occur due to the adenosine deaminase deficiency. Now the adenosine deaminase catalyzes the conversion of adenosine to ionosine and what happens it's this deficiency it results in accumulation of adenosine which interferes with purine metabolism and it results in an accumulation of nucleotide metabolites which are particularly toxic to the developing T cells. So this is about the immunodeficiency diseases first one which we learned about the severe combined immunodeficiency so tomorrow we will continue the same uh, stay tuned for more lessons to come thank you for watching